Welcome brothers and sisters. Welcome to a prophetic word from one of our members, from our brother Chris. I will read it to you and I will add the transcript to the first pink comment. It's about the implanted microchip. This dream was received by Brother Chris on October 3rd, 2020, around 5.30 a.m. I am walking out of a high school hallway. I see a black dragon on the floor as the school's mascot. I am with my mother. I walk through the front door. I see a large black lock on the door which unlocks to allow myself, my mother and my brother to walk out of the building. I then looked back and saw the doors, then that had been locked while a student seemingly had tried to get out and was unsuccessful, looking through the glass door at me. I walk out I see men stationed in front of the school, behind a white plastic desk, next to one of the school's brick walls. There was seemingly a checkpoint, with men in white shirts, stuff most likely. My mom and I then walked a few yards away over to another checkpoint. This time there are stuff in white shirts again, sitting, standing behind what seems to be a grocery store checkout station. It seems to be an outside market of some sort, with crates of fruit such as mangoes and bananas, with a huge white tent over it all. We then walk past the store checkpoint towards the crates of fruit. All of a sudden, my mom starts telling me to get the mark asking me why haven't I gotten it yet. I tell her I'm not getting it while thinking I would rather die for Christ than get it. We walk past a screen that displayed an X-ray of the entire human body to show if they had taken the mark with the mark showing up as a red mark. I then see a man wearing a blue uniform and over it something which seems to be a red emergency vest. This man must have been an employee. He realized that I did not have the mark. He asked me why I did not have it. He then pulls out a syringe out of his vest pocket. I raise my hand to block his incoming strike, inadvertently getting injected in the process. The man then proceeds to take a handheld electronic thermometer and scans my forehead. I then remember what happens to those who get the mark. They spend eternity in hell. For if one takes the mark, they are betraying God himself. The dream ends. I then hear the Holy Spirit. He says, this is a vision that the Lord has given you. Going forward, we, as Christians and followers of God Almighty, need to become extra cautious if the pre-tribulation rapture does not happen, or if it does, you are left behind. If the pre-tribulation rapture does not happen, then you can still make the coming rapture, but instead of coming before the tribulation beginning, it will either happen during the middle of the tribulation just prior to God's was being poured out and upon the earth and its inhabitants or after the end of the tribulation at which it coincides with the second coming. Either way we need to be careful. God bless, watch over and protect each of you who received this message regardless of how you do it and how you receive it. The Lord wants me to add a prayer. Here it is. For those who hearing this voice, this young adult, 24-year-old man's dream, 
I say this to you. I hear you and I will protect you with my mighty, righteous hand. Do not be afraid. I am here for you. Come to me now and spend time with me. I adore your time spent with me. So will you not come and spend some time with me? That is all. Maybe there will be people such as a man in the red emergency vest in the tribulation. All Christians then must be even more careful than before, trying to avoid the authorities and people that will report them, such as friends and family members. For if this is a case, any employee could, in, in this case, or even a regular citizen, citizen who is one who is rules obsessed, could have won at this point in time as of the year of the deadly coronavirus pandemic in 2020. I think most people know, heard stories or seen videos in the past few months of such people by being given one voluntarily by Satan's human authority. Being allowed to carry the mark in Western form to go after myself as a fellow brother in Christ in the dream and other Christians trying to avoid the Antichrist or even other rebels, so to speak, against the Antichrist regime. Brothers and sisters, this is a message and a dream received from our brother in Christ, Chris. Please read it. Then you will understand it more clearly. I will put a transcript of the message in the first pink comment. Thank you that you also listen to dreams and visions that our members, members of Triple Grace and, and members in Christ have received. May God bless you and your family abundantly. Stay safe. Amen and Amen. Maranatha.